ISTQB Foundation Level, Question 138. The test results are locked is a part of which phase? A. Test implementation B. Test execution C. Test completion D. Test analysis Take a moment to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon to don't miss new ISTQB questions and answers that will help you guaranteed and changing your skills. Join us on this learning journey. If you find value in that I do and my videos help you, then you have the option to donate through the links in the video description to I can release new videos on ISTQB questions on a regular basis. To answer this question, it's enough remember what each phase includes. Correct answer is B. Test execution phase includes running the tests and the test results are logged. All the rest of the answers are wrong. Answer A is wrong because test implementation includes creating or occurring the testware necessary for test execution. For example, test data. At this phase, testers don't run test cases and don't log test results. Answer C is wrong because test completion includes analyzing milestones to identify lessons, learning and improvements for future iterations, releases or projects. At this phase, testers don't run test cases and don't log test results. Answer D is wrong because test analysis includes analyzing the test basis to identify testable features and to define and prioritize associated test conditions. At this phase, testers don't run test cases and don't log test results. My recommendation. Please, figure out all the test activities and test phases with examples in the ISTQB syllabus. Explanation. At last, let's look at the section 1.4.1 .1, test activities and tasks in the ISTQB syllabus, where we can see that test execution includes running the tests in accordance with the test execution schedule, test runs. Test execution may be manual or automated. Test execution can take many forms, including continuous testing, pair testing sessions, actual test results are compared with the expected results. The test results are logged. Anomalies are analyzed to identify their likely causes. This analysis allows us to report the anomalies based on the failures observed. This is fully consistent with the correct answer B. I think this question is not difficult for you if you remember all the phases of test activities. I wish you good luck in the ISTQB Foundation level exam. Never give up!